dime. For every place, city skylines do. Um, so, I had been waiting until the first DLC comes out, but I decided that I wasn't going to do that. Instead, I was going to play because I've been watching City Planner plays and it just makes me want to play a game. So I'm going to save Sunshine Peninsula for when I do, when we do get those, um, whatchamacallums, uh, um, when we do get the um, expansion pack, um, because I did want to build something with the uh, beachfront assets uh, front of mind, top of mind, I guess I should say. Um, so let's see here. I think Coral Riches is one of the new maps they added. It's the one that um, uh, City Planner Plays has been playing uh, live. Um, let's see, Waterway Pass. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to try Waterway Pass. Why not? So it's Northern Hemisphere. It can snow or be super hot. Half of the area is buildable. It's got highway, it's got rail, it's got ship, it's got airplane, it's got electricity. Let's give it a shot. Uh, Goldfield. I'm going to call it Goldfield County. Because I'm going to go the... Um, uh, I'm going to say... <coughs> no tutorials. Um, I'm, I'm going to kind of go the way City Planner Plays is going, where there's kind of like a whole bunch of little communities that all tie together. Um, I, I kind of like how that goes compared to where I just started from one area and just expanded out continuously. Um, so uh, one of the first things I learned um, since my first game is that there's no need to build a power plant because we can just build a... Um, what you might call it, a uh, transformer off of here and get power. Um, the other thing that I've learned is that I don't necessarily um, have to start right here. We can always have something come back to this. And then finally, I kind of want to um, uh, make a big, not necessarily big, huge, but make a grid first and then go from there um, as a city planner plays often does because I think it leads to more natural looking and pre-planned um, cities. So, um, just taking a look at here, we've got the gravel road, we've got the alley, um, got the pedestrian street. Oh, I want to try and use alleys to um, to do some loading on and off of rather than having people load on and on to um, um, streets. Uh, all right, so right now we've just got access to the four lane road um, and the two lane roads, well, up to three lanes. Um, so, yeah, let's start off. Um, let's see. So, I think what I want to do is uh, I like what City Planner Plays always says about respecting the topography, although, this is some. But, potentially bananas topography here um, where it said it was flat between the um, mountains but I maybe on that side over here this seems to mean to me that there, there's a, a big decline that's what it looks like so we might need to think about this a little bit so I one of the things I like that he does is he puts like um, some pedestrian areas out here by the kind of like makes the um, the rivers and the lakes to be more like park areas. And I like how that stuff ends up looking. So I, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on the continuous tool and just to just as like a kind of a boundary maybe starting well. Let me see, let me turn it around this way. Where do we actually have room to expand? 
Well, it might be, you know what, it might be worth just kind of like setting that up so I can kind of make sure I'm following things up. So let's kind of go that. No, that, that ended up too close. That's not what I wanted at all. Let's try that again. All right, let's do complex curve. Maybe that's what I actually want anyway. We're gonna go up. There we go, yep. All right, I think maybe we'll do that. And then I'll do, let's see. Let's see, what's, what size are we gonna end up doing here? Um, All right, so if we start from, let's say here, let's do, all right, we'll do 71 yards and we'll do, all right, we'll do 71 by 99. How does that look? Let's see. And then, so yeah, we've got this weird topography going on here because this is just sloping way up from the the river. It's, it's kind of bonkers. Um, <coughs> let's see here. So if we were to do, grab this guy. Actually, I think what I want to do is get rid of this here. And then maybe... Just go like that. So that we've got... We don't want to make it full strength. More like full strength. Alright. There we go. Just kind of... That makes sense. Are we just going to end up with like a... I feel like... This map is not... I mean, this is one of the maps that came with the game, and those maps are all about... Bananas topography. Um, that. Is that really what I want? What are we doing here? Uh, things have gone bananas now. All right, I uh, let's get out of this. This is no good. All right, let's try coral riches. Maybe maybe their newer map is a little more sane. We'll do we'll do Milford County. Let's see if this is a more of a sane starting map. <laughs> All right, this looks way better. <laughs> way less bonkers. All right, so over here we've got trains that just randomly stop. 
Um, got this weird thing going on over here. What the heck is this? It's, it's like someone was like designing the train tracks and got bored halfway through. All right. Fair enough. All right, so we've got electricity over here. We've got the highway over there. All right. I'm going to start. You know what? I'm going to start where the electricity is because that's what I want to do. All right, so now let's do this. All right, so I'm going to start off here. Let's do, let's see what sizes do we have that make sense. Let's do... Alright, we'll do 105. Do we go double and then do like those uh, pedestrian walkways? Those are kind of cool behind each one. Let's see, so something like 140. So 105 by 140. Alright, we actually end up with a full thing, but... Um... So what we would do would be like a pathway, maybe like halfway, is that halfway through? One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, and okay. So actually, technically, we should probably have gone one more so it can actually be halfway, but put it there. All right, something like that, which gives us like uh, some some smaller parcels, um, some walkability. Uh, so let's yeah, let's do that. So that was uh, what was that again? Gotta write this down somewhere. 105, 105, 105 by 140. Okay, so I'm gonna <coughs> set up a few of these here. do a transformer from here. And we can do a power line from there to there. Something like that, maybe, maybe not, I don't know. here. Maybe it was just too close somehow. There we go. Alright, so that takes care of power. Um, so we've got this over here. Then I think what I'm going to do is kind of I'm going to keep this as like a forested area. So I'm going to have my road. Let's see. I'm 
I come like this. Um, over. There we go. Something like that, maybe. Um, but should that have all been that big road? I'm not entirely sure. Probably not, I'm guessing. to delete all right at any rate we've got that going on here. The beard. There we go. Okay. Um... We've got that set up. And so... <clears throat> we do another one here that went from... 's so now we would connect let's see go to simple curve oh there we go okay. Um, might be like a park area or something. All right. And then we could, let's see, we'll kind of continue the grid over here. We'll do over here. We'll do, go up, up uh, 140. over wait was that at a 90 I, need, I didn't I wasn't paying attention all right 
up 140. And over 105. Right there. Perfect. All right. Cool, 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 cool. All right. And then... Okay. Right there. Okay. Right. Hey. I wish I could play. Brush your teeth yet? Go brush your teeth. Turn off snapping here. There we go. How delightful. All right. Another letter from our Do at least Paris another Paris. one here. Hmm. What's up, honey? Me and my sister love you. Oh, that's nice. Y'all got clarinets and violins, but you got something much Perfect. music these days, ain't All right, and these old yes, lineage traced back to the great up somehow so. here. Let's see here. Y'all got soul. Actually, oh, I yes. think leave like that. Soul. That looks really cool like that. And then we'll have let's see my sister say this guy playing the keys got more funk in his pinky. Hmm, but I told right there. You that ain't funk. That's classical. All right. Yes, indeed. Cool. That must be most exacerbated. Alright, and then we'll do some more connections here, and then I'll start zoning. Funk, by contrast, is an entirely modern conceit, and you'll find none of that here. Funk, as they say, is for the lay person. Now, let's hear another one of those soulful cants. Alright. Like one, though. No, you know what? Let's see here, we can go up another one. Oh, wait, before I forget. Extreme path. And then we'll actually keep it. Let's see, let's go pedestrian path curve tool. And we'll go like that. Okay. Um, and we might as well also have a way to get to the reserve over there. Oops. Okay. Um. Right, out here we can go another. Okay. Oh, perfect. We'll just have that one. Let's see. Tie into there. There we go. Although I guess there's no way to get rid of that. Do we have road services? Right. And we'll have this one. there and one final connection actually let's see
Oh. Right. So let's see. Forty would put us about out there. Interesting. And here we'll do a curve. Okay. All right. Those are interesting looking. I don't think we have any kind of parks yet, do we? Not even the smallest amount. Alright, so... In that case, let's put some housing. And we'll leave it at that for now. Let's go. Yep. That's fine. That's what I wanted to do to start with. Oh, we need to worry about water. That's right. So, water. All right, let's. I'm going to put one right here. And then for the. Wastewater treatment. Um, for now, I guess I'm gonna have to use a sewage outlet. Um, put it out there for now. Care of everything. Maybe, maybe not. Hmm. Oh, this thing get connected somehow. happy now. Right. All those are building up. Going to let's see. Look at the wind. Wind is blowing up, 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 up. All right. Um, I think for now, I'm just gonna, um, do I ignore industrial for now? Definitely gonna put some commercial demand out here. 
would definitely be a place that commercial would want to be. And there would definitely be some commercial zones in here. got that going on. Um, did I just do that? And not sure. All right. Um, <coughs> so we still have some more demand for residential, but we'll fill this in here. I just end up recoloring that. I did not mean to. There we go. All right. It's been a little bit since I played. Okay. So that's going up. that goes up. I, mean, I guess I'll... Let's see. I guess I'll do some industrial over here. Going up, I guess... See, I'm really condemning, like, almost the whole map, in a way, because of the way the wind's blowing, but maybe we can keep it low for now and then eventually maybe buy a tile out here somewhere uh, until then we'll go ahead and put some here we'll go ahead and mm -hmm. local authorities are urging the public oh, to I'm gonna make a reduce the burden on the city during this water shortage a little bit up this way low flush toilet Cut back on watering the lawn and shower right. with a friend. Let's see. Do we have a water this shortage? A local public service announcement. No, we're, we're barely using it. Second Moon Radio, your second music right. home from home. So settle back in your chair, pour yourself a glass, and for so I'm gonna come over here. Not for here. We'll pull. We are doing a musical tour. Make our grid. Italia, mm -hmm. land of art and culture. <laughs> que bon, as they say. And an aria inspired by the infamous Vivaldi shall be our guide. Alright, so this time... Uh, you know what? There should also be pedestrian paths in here because... People might want to walk to work or so on. Actually, we'll do what we'll do is we'll do like an alley right here and divide the two, allow for some more space for these industries. Let's see, we'll kind of go like that, that, maybe up like that, and we'll do another alley going up that way. Actually, let's see. So here's an alley, and then here we'll do a pedestrian. Maybe that's how I'll do my industrial for now. We'll just have this go up like that. Over here we'll do industrial. Alright, and just that little bit took care of everything else we needed. Now we just need more residential. Alright, let's see if we can make it to level 1 and that'll be it for this episode. So yeah, some of these interesting things here. You know what? I might take advantage now while we're waiting. Make a, like a little... Well, you know what? I'm not going to make a path yet because that'd be maybe a good place for a, a park. And we can see how to connect into that afterwards. Uh, we're still looking for more residential. We'll go ahead and zone some here. <coughs> and here 
here as well. We'll end up with three different lots at least. We'll leave that one alone. Um, we'll leave that one alone as a potential park or something. And let's see. I think this is a good spot for some more residential here. Potentially. Oops. Zoning them by accident. All right. Um, so over here, what have we got? Okay, yeah, we've got some stuff going on there. All right. Um, and then we've got some coming out over here. We've got some industrial coming up over here. Um, residential in here. You're listening to Second Moon, the epitome of classical <laughs> epitome. Home, or wherever you roam. The leader of the City Services Division is with us in the studio today to talk about why they're contracting with outside agencies to provide vital services for our residents. Isn't that going to be costly, Mr. Councilman? Oh, well, quite frankly, yes. It is an additional expense, but the residents have come to expect a certain level of services, and we simply do not have the capacity to provide them within the city. This is a Sounds relatively like new survey. will end up paying for it. Should we be worried? I expect the residents would be more distressed if key services became unavailable. Their quality of life is very important to them. But so is their money. So we've got 10 people living here. Over here we've got our little... Main Street. Coming off the highway. We have a little more industrial demand. We're going to kind of make it go up this way. Oh. Trying to snap with something. Oh, whoopsie, that is not the road I was looking for. There you go. Maybe that was the cause of the problems. Alright, uh, let's turn snapping back on. way as well like that. kind of bananas definitely not realistic but I'm even more of a don't let the perfect be enemy of the good than the under plays is I'm going and drop in some more residential here Hey, they've got solar panels. Very cool. Alright. Continue on this way. Do 
we have enough for 140? We do not. So we will not continue in that direction. <laughs> uh, let's see. We can, oh, we can keep going this from this grid that we have here. Nope. Uh, I guess we'll make a new one. We'll make a new grid going this way. There we go. Look at that. Ready. Getting interestingly complicated here. All right, so we'll go up. 140. Over 105. Back down. And then, yeah, here we're going to end up slightly odd because we've got this road coming in like that. Um... But maybe we can fix things a bit here by something like that. Very least to fix those up there. All right, goes in. <coughs> All right, we'll continue things this way. That's extra long. Technically, you only want to go to here. You know what? We'll let it slide for... Let's see. Let's have an alleyway. We'll kind of go... Actually... Let's not do the alleyway there. Maybe... Hmm. Well... That's for sure I have a pavement path. And connect it with that one there. There we go. Alright, I think let's do some commercial in this corner. In this corner. We'll do... We'll just... Setting that up for later since we don't have demand at the moment. We'll put those there. at a founding. Let's see what we can do to reestablish our block sizes here. Let's see. Let's start from here. We'll go here. We'll go up 140. There we go. All right, and then I think what I'll do is here, I'll go over 105. Down. And then maybe what I'll do is I'll take a road that'll come like that. There we go. All right, then maybe this will be some kind of parks or amenities or something. We'll figure it out. But now we've reestablished our block sizes, which is good. Um, we'll go ahead and continue with our ads here. We'll cut across like that. Residential here. <coughs> All right, so we've got this interesting little community, some commercial mixed in, some residential, and I have some small parks and other things in here. This is going to be a big um, wooded area park. All right, let's, let's keep going for now. We're almost. Almost where we need to be here. Here we're almost 
there. Like we maybe need a little more industrial. Oh, well, these are still coming up, but I think this is more dynamic than it was in Skylines 1, if I remember correctly. So, go ahead and something odd going on here. <laughs> Lumber yard or something over here. here will be a park or something, but up here will be residential. And soon we'll probably start purposely making smaller lots, because some of these are going to be complaints later. Potentially. I think that's what City Planner plays eventually found, is that if you let all the lots be huge, then there's nowhere for people with less money to live. Tiny village. Huzzah. Alright, so we've got a loan limit. Got three more map tiles. Got the city budget, city statistics. We've got row housing. We've got roads. This is Second Moon Radio Classical for the Modern Age. Unlike Alright, so we've got healthcare and death care. Got garbage management. Someone sitting in front of a sheet of blank paper using only their right, so we don't yet have districts right that comes through a silent audible masterpiece now here we sit listening at full at grand village okay so let's just plop in healthcare and death care and but let us not tarry and fill in that stuff let's see you go here 
Got one point available. So, usually when you get these, your folks kind of want them right away. So, let's see. Probably, let's see where this little clinic fit, if anywhere. snapping for a minute. Okay, I wasn't sure if I turned off snapping if there was somewhere I could fit it. Alright, that's fine. Let's turn snapping back on. Um looks like we can put it right here in this little triangle. Ah, the parking lot's what I was missing because it was like a weird color. Let's see. And this be moved back just a little bit. I think I have to turn off snapping, let me see. Okay, cool. Um, so I've got that now. And um, but now let's see, where's that cover? All right, everyone's got availability, excellent. We will go now to Uh, uh, death care. Now the cemeteries in this game are incredibly huge. Uh, but they also don't as much use as the crematoriums do, but... What if we put it... Let me see. Let's make like an alley. No, a ah, so service vehicles that works. If we were to kind of do, mm -hmm. let's see. Be something like a little bit more. That would allow people to walk there as well as an underhill like that. Um, not entirely sure. I'll leave it for now. And then what was the other thing we got? We got the landfill. Um, so this I'm gonna put out here. Um, you know, actually, this might be something to save for figuring out where we want it. Place it so that it's not 
impeding future growth or anything. Waiting for a hearse, okay. Alright, I think that's it for today. This has been Eric playing City Skylines 2. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.